it is your box so today we're going to talk about where does the wind come from i know the wind comes from i'm a big fan for earth and millions of millions of millions of trillions and one infinity of people turn on the big fan because it's very heavy not only one person can do it but millions and one infinity people can turn on the fan and it's big for the earth and that's how we get wind now what is wind wind is air molecules M- movement of air molecules and and when um when the sea is cold with the cold air molecules and the land is hot with the hot air molecules it's um and the main bit of the whole um sea and the land bit is the sun the sun is controlling everything and the sun can't just give like um all of the hot air to the all of the world right so it has to give like example if it's like um one place one place is here one place is there and this is the sea and the sun gives hot kind of hot and cold in the uh, into this place and this play um the sun gives to this place cold air molecules so and then in the land if the air hot air molecules evaporate and go up in the sky then what will happen the next thing what will happen is the cold air molecules will refill the place will come quickly it's like you see it's like it's like that then um it will be like quickly and you know how we see from our window outside when it's very cold and i'm like oh i don't want to go outside i don't want to go outside maybe tomorrow it will be hot and i'll be able to go outside but not today i'm very cold ooh if you like that then you see the wind that means the air molecules are um coming to leaf in the place since the land is not hot and and it, it got evaporated to the uh, and it got up evaporated then the air molecules cold air molecules want to refill the place so all all over the world all over the healthy planet will be like if it's not uh, if the hot air molecules evaporate then the cold air molecules will come and then that's how um and that's called sea breeze and now that's the same thing that will happen to the land as well so in the night time the land will be very cold but the sea in the night time will be very warm and cozy but since the air hot air molecules lift up from the sea and um you know in, uh, that in the night time that the land is very cold so the cold air molecules from the land refill to the sea and that's called land breeze just like sea breeze now we just saw that um where the wind come from but have you ever wondered what will happen if there is no wind i'll sweat and sweat i'll be like <sighs> when it cold air any cold air please no and the first point is for no wind um is in the factories you know how they work and if there is no wind then the dirty air won't go up evaporate up but if there is wind then it will evaporate up and it will swish away the dirt out but if there is no wind and it's still at the same spot then it will make a toxic smell and we can't breathe properly very stinky the second point is of no wind um if there is no wind then for the um the sea and the land as we talked before will not exchange you know how we talked about like it exchange um weathers 
that's that will that will be really great but if it we don't exchange then it will be not good because in the land it will be very hot but in the sea it will be very cold and the third point is sailing or kite um if there is no wind but if there is wind then the boat can go flow yes in the um, in the sea by nothing problem just relaxing in the boat and you it's just like going closely with also uh, at the same for the kite as well when a person is getting the kite the kite will fly up and we'll able to see it and it will be really fun but if there's no wind then the boat will stop just like this then the boat won't go like uh, uh, and the captain will be like oof oof i have to push the boat it will be like that and also same with the kite the kite will be like oh my kite it will be like that and the fourth point is um birds which is like if there is no uh, if there is wind for the birds there they will be able to fly uh beautifully and it will it and it will lift up um and the wind will lift up the bird easily and it don't have to go up by itself but if there's no wind it has to do this every time and the bird will get tired and it has to sit somewhere and it has to take some rest and then go back it's not good right and the fifth point is um plant which is like if there is no wind if there is wind the plants will be like wind um 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 and the fifth point is windmill which um have you seen those big fans um beside each other if there is wind then it will spin and the electricity that we use on our phones our laptops or our even our ipad or ipod um will work but if there is no wind then the um f- um big fan will stop and there is no electricity for us it will just be like not like that and hope you enjoyed this video and now you know why uh, now you know why if there is no wind or where does the wind come from hope you enjoyed this video thanks for watching bye bye have a great time